everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Studios. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to go ahead and remap your controller with the Victress uh, app on your computer. And this is easy to do. All you have to do is go to configure right here, select this, and then you can go to buttons. And to remap it, just go to the original button down here. And this is cross, choose the button. So we can go to like a uh, D-pad up. So you can see the original button right here. And then the new button you can remap it to. So we have D-pad up, and then go on down to whatever we want to select. So uh, I would never remap the D-pad up button, but we can go to like the left trigger. So every time we press the D-pad up, this is going to be left trigger. So we can remap that too. Now, if you do get to the point where a trigger is remapped, you don't have the triggers on here, but we can go over to the, uh, the triggers right here. You can see the left trigger we can actually remap this to any button. So if we want, I don't know, uh, our trigger to be jump, actually, and then maybe map L1 to fire. Some people like doing that. Well, you can do that. Just remap the trigger down here. And whatever you select the left trigger to, it's going to be so the right triggers over here. So you might want to bring down the left trigger too. It's, it's really sensitive. But you can go back to the buttons. So if you don't want to do this by pressing the function button or the little uh, remap button on the back of the controller, you can just use the app on the computer and it works just as well. There's no X and O must always be mapped on the controller. Okay, so you got that right there. And then you got the back paddles you can map to. Just select one of the B buttons and then your analog sticks right here. And uh, you should be good to go. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. It did. Leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.